What's up guys, this is the Rifleman and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as Russia. So to round off up on last time, we successfully captured Damascus and the Swedes have sneakily run round and captured Finland from under me. Which is fine, not really that bothered. It's what I'm tempted to do is capture Finland, ship this army over by sea and then threaten Stockholm directly. Uh, maybe even recruit a second army to threaten Stockholm with two stacks and then I can then put one push onto Norway. One push on to Copenhagen, and then just get rid of their fleets as a risk. Maybe. I don't know. Oh yeah, I remember being a bit concerned about <laughs> all of that sat over the border. Uh, whatever money you've left, try to replenish what you can. Cool. End turn. Because yeah, I really need to... We don't need to do anything, just push on and capture territories. They keep trying to buy techs from me. It's not going to happen. I need to check what my victory conditions are as Russia. I'm still quite early on, but I've captured a, a good amount of stuff, I think. And within over the horizon, I'm looking at another... Two, three, four, five... Four or five more towns. Factory in Sweden, that's probably almost more up to ten. One of them being Finland. Um, that's right. You keep on walking. See, everyone's after this very high quality Russian knowledge. Absolute tip top to a condition. You want to buy some plans to build an RBMK reactor? Just don't be a, don't be stupid when you're running it, and don't don't hit AZ five. Oh, that's a brilliant show. I'm going to buy it when it comes out. Even buy on DVD. I don't generally buy physical media unless I really, really enjoy it. So I bought things like Thor Ragnarok. Which good. I might buy Infinity War and Because I'm not a superhero fan, nominally. Um, but I thought they were very, very good. So I want them to make more. And the best way to make more is to buy the, is to actually pay for the things you like so that it makes the numbers better so they go, ooh, this has been good. This has done well. Maybe we should do it. A new nation arises, the Cherokee. Good, the Cherokee rebelled against the Brits. Um, corn plantation. Start exporting more stuff. Can't recruit anything useful. Howitzer, that'll do. Sims, I'm I should just let it do wedge. Fifteen, eleven, seven. I think I do. But first, go back to Moscow. Build a modern university, build two modern universities, and how much does this make everyone hate me? Plus four. In which case, here, have some militia to try to balance it out. I don't have that yet, do I? Is that secular humanism? Nope. Can't build the super top observatory. Um, is there any more places growing? Nope, nowhere's growing. Smith, Smith. I think it should be okay. Much have more of a garrison at Moscow than I'd like. Oh yeah, this army that's doing the weird way around maintain siege for now. Um, yeah, the army that's making a weird, the long way around uh, the Black Sea rather than crossing over Istanbul, which I'm okay with. Um, I'm not in a rush to push through Greece. Um, more of a rush to push through North Africa because Jerusalem's just a hop, skip and jump away. Um, that army that comes down around the Black Sea from the northeast, they will go to Bulgaria, and the army that's in Istanbul now will swing south towards Athens. And it's tempting if I can push the Italian states off of the peninsula, if I can if I can conquer them, just defeat defeat them, and then make peace with them straight away. Because sometimes the I can do that if you do if you cause enough of a loss on them, they will um, make peace in scenarios like that. See, the Ottomans stealing all my tech, but it's not going to help them out. Yeah, I was wondering if they'd sally out. Guess not. 
You're going to regret this, Mughal Empire. I swear, I'm going to go in there and take everything. Of course, that's the end. Oh, no, pirates still pirating. Reorganised procurement. Uh, fire in advance. Plus one training, yeah, okay. Punch card loom. That might be a better idea. I'm not so bothered about fire in advance. Water mills. Grand Opera House. Not a military academy, because it doesn't really matter yet. Yeah, mass recruiting on in Jerusalem because they know what's coming. I think I do. Do I expand? Infrastructure. Roads. Do some road building. Doesn't matter where. Just build some roads. So it doesn't even have to be in the optimal places. Cool. So they're already rock and roll. When they finish replenishing, push on to Jerusalem. A small army to go take Transylvania when Austria inevitably declares war on me. Imagine again, they're very friendly and they keep see they're offering us less and less and less money, so I'm hoping that means that their financial situation is going down the crapper. At least that's the hope. Anyway. Could well not be the case. Ooh, missionary in Turkey. Building farms here will help the Good. population to grow. All the dogs, all the dogs. Let's go start conveying Azerbaijan. You come down here and try and assassinate this. Pr uh, can't remember what you call Islamic preachers. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Yeah, let's build up Turkey. Right. Let's build up you as well. Push on to Jerusalem. Maintain siege for now? I don't know. Oh, they're fine. <laughs> Got to be a religious unrest, but my, my chaps will work their way around. We're going to school an army board just to get rid of some of the golden hammers. Military governor's encampment. Infrastructure. Somewhere is getting metal roads. You, Archangelsk. One and a half thousand. They're growing quite fast. Brought in lots of tanks. Lots of pelts. Successful mission in Bulgaria. So where's that army? See, because they're not following metal roads. Just set them auto attack Bulgaria when they come round. Cool. Maybe recruit a unit of militia to push this ship out of my port. Right, end turn. And then end turn, and finally. 
the wedge formation that the, ga the game desperately wants me to research will be complete. Well, then again, maybe it bounces around to whatever's the lowest turn count. Maybe the fastest next piece of research, if you're not paying attention. So that even if you do forget and come back to it, it's not been grinding away at some high value thing that you don't necessarily want. Maybe? Bit of a guess. It's got pressure. <laughs> What is it with Prussia? Just sitting there and just going, Prussia. Cool. Ah, oh, oh, the Prussians pushed the Poles back. I'm surprised I'm not at war with... No, oh, no, I am at war with Prussia. I was just about to go, why am I not at war with Prussia? And I realise I keep sitting back in my chair and I'm talking and I hope you can still hear me, but I realise I'm not actually up in my microphone as I should be. It's got Venice. Genoa. There is unused land suitable for plantations in this region. Smashing. It's just going to keep telling me about the same plantations because it's the plantations. Um, oh, I am, I am building an army board, so I am going to get the new tech. Yeah, you're going to get those things too because you're going to be on the frontier if. Ooh. Who is that? Who is doing that to you? Hmm. Do I want to fight this battle now before this army shows up? I think I do. So that's, that's another. That's no, just a heavy cavalry. I thought it was a second general's bodyguard. Let us fight. We've not had a battle yet this turn. The weekend. Where's my? I'm just gonna pl plug my headphones in for charge. My wireless ones. A walk out later, get some sun. Right. So, because I'm the superior in Russian bear, I've got many, many, many more troops. So, they are going to want to fight in the towns and be a bit mucky. I do not want to do that. So, I'm going to deploy my artillery units out here just to fire. Just kind of fire towards the town in this general area. Maybe I'll give them. You can each have a militia unit in case they get swamped. I'm fairly sure my militia is still actually quite... The yeah, enters a melee. Melee attack quite good. Defence is still quite good compared to regular line. Ooh, I forgot about these guys. These guys look like ring wraiths in the picture. So let's do... I'll just give them them. There's a bit of protection. Like I'm assuming the AI might pull off some tricks to make it not quite as easy. Actually, I'm going to do this. And you are cavalry. Let's include you over here. Cool, that's what I would like. Well, yeah, see they've deployed right in the town. Demi cannons. Yeah, I'm going to want to swing to the right. limber up my artillery. Yeah, so this is the problem with those... So, where is it? Right. 
Yeah, as soon as my units pass out of this arc, then this artillery unit is worthless. Right, where's my ring wraiths? Get my ring wraiths over here. Get my militia over here too. Square, form square. This isn't going to go the way you wanted, Sweden. Even they are heavy cavalry. Chop, chop, chop with my peasants with their big axes. My grenadiers are going to make it a bit more complicated for you too. Okay, let's move in. Start trying to capture the town. Because they're trying to flank around. But ultimately, I don't mind doing this because it means that I'll get a, I'll be able to break down their artillery. Keep my artillery safe and out of the way. See, they reform the lines. If I wanted to move up here, I'd then be f fired upon by their artillery. But I don't want that, obviously. Assume you can't garrison the town hall, that would be great fun. You can garrison this little building though. Well, there you go, they've called their general advance. That's their general. Dang, could have got some freebie, tr freebie kills on their general. Storm the artillery position. Provincial militia should be an easy win. Yeah, you are against grenadiers, and more grenadiers are good. They're just 
So you stuck on a cannon. Provincials, provincial militias on the go. Not routing, just. Just get some shots in on them. Get to a bit of combat now. Cavalry army. Devastating. Fire by rank. Go. Oh, devastating losses. Run them up. Just in case General's bodyguard fancies fancies exposing himself. We are Russian after all. Charging, hitting them with bayonets. Get my militia in. Manually charge my cav in. All of them. Got the Swedes in the in the cauldron. My general's dead instantly and killed their general. Dang. And they are Marines. See, my militia's quite handy if I can get them in just to chop stuff. See if they chop down this drummer. Oh no, they're off. The Swedes. Excellent. Finland is oh god. <laughs> Where did all they come from? Well, get me another general. I can't build any walls. Could be another interesting fight. Clearances. 
You get the walls in Baghdad are built. My militia's down there. Out you go. Let's get this trading port built. Repaired, sorry. So if I move this army out of here, they don't hate me, but I don't really get a garrison either. So why don't I recruit some expat infantry just in case these guys fancy a crack? Then move them on ready to push in next turn. Sweet. Heroic death. Prince? Uh-oh. Well, I've got a brilliant min naval minister, but I don't have a navy. Could build one, though. No, I'm going to get... Um... See, these areas... See, they, so Armenia can export through Turkey. They don't have a port. They don't have a port. Yeah, I'm going to get a trade port. Just to produce stuff. Because I'm fairly... I think all goods you trade can travel one adjacent province. Um, let's scout with an infantry unit. Oh, not quite far enough. Cool, alright. End turn. The army marches on. In France still. <laughs> so the plan's going well. Marched on, captured some territories, recaptured some, ter re some territories. Um, I think she'd be in a good spot to attack. Ooh. Oh, phew. I do have a garrison there, so they've not just broken my uh, my my port. Uh, but Poland, you're still okay. Oh, it's Austria. It was Austria that captured Minsk. Yeah, I'm definitely going to be at war with Austria at some point then. So they're pushing up Serbia. They split, so they might just go start raiding. In which case, I'm going to send that army around south and just have them move on Athens. Opportunity to intercept. I think yes, because I'm still in quite good shape. And they've, they've not got these guys supporting them, so all in that's probably, the, on balance, the best thing to do. But, looking at the time... It looks like it's the end of this part. So thanks for watching, guys. We'll conclude this in the next section.